Yo, Shane, who could be on my dick? For real, though. Dead serious. Stop coming to my page, stealing my content, and then create your own narrative. That's what y'all doing. You come to my page, you steal my pictures and my videos, and then you create the narrative that you want it to be. No. No. What's happening is soon I'm going to say y'all defaming my character and let my lawyer handle it. That's up to y'all, though. I'm telling you. That's what's next because you're coming on my page, stealing my content, and then creating a narrative around the content from my page for your page. Keep it up. Keep it up. No problem. Yo, so um, that was Cam uh, going in on the shade room. And since he made that statement, they took down the post where about five days ago or so um, on his new sports show. First, first of all, shout out to Cam for going in a different direction. Uh, Linking him, seeing him, seeing him and Mace all these years back together. Their chemistry is natural. It's pretty cool. Um, I remember Joe Budden and Nori and a few people was talking like, oh, man, some of these rappers is trying anything and they can't get nothing. Cam put money into his own stuff. He got his own production studio and he's doing something else instead of getting into that oversaturated podcast lane. But nonetheless, he made a, a statement about the Jonathan Majors and John, Michael B. Jordan pictures that came out and he basically said the same thing most of us said when we seen it like yo this look kind of suspect like you know what I mean like I can see if that's father and son maybe but that was kind of sus the way that the pictures looked and Cam said it of course you know he's Mr. Pause uh, and the shade room took it just so because they knew people were going to get upset they knew the LGBT the alphabet mafia was going to get mad and they went in on Killer for like days and on in trying to sabotage the brand of his new show before it even gets picked up because what they're doing right now they're putting it on youtube but they're trying to these are like pilots that they're shooting they're, they're doing them twice a week or whatever they're trying to get picked up by a major network which is smart so cam can't really afford to have people smearing dirt on his name just for him being honest and being true to himself that's who he is you know and honestly shade room for our, it's like I call out black media all the time. Like, yeah, some of the stuff they put out there is informable, but they put out a lot of nonsense. And a lot of people who work for that, who run that page are alphabet people. Let's be honest. It's a lot of gay guys and, and women running that page. So, of course, they put that out there so that they could swarm them. And it's crazy. Some of the same people from this community that used to get ran off the block back in the day, picked on, beat up in school, chased down the block, whatever. Now they all form like Voltron and they the bullies. You say anything crazy, they bully you and, and make you apologize. So that's what they were trying to do with that small clip without even watching the whole show, without having any real context. Um, that's what they were doing. And now he's like, yo, y'all either gonna take that shit down, which they have already immediately, because it's been up for like five days or I'm a sue for defamation because y'all defaming my character. <laughs> you know, like they ain't, he ain't playing with them. So I like the way he moved with that because Shade Room can be very messy sometimes, man. Real, real messy. They know what they was doing with that. They knew the, 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 the queen crowd was going to come at his neck and, and paint him as this toxic masculinity figure, you know, and, and all of that. So. But that's going to come because, you know, they don't like the way Cam, you know, how Cam jokes sometimes. But if you're a fan of Cam and you know how he joke, you know, that's just that's just the essence of who he is. Uh, but, yeah, Cameron is threatening Shade Room for defaming his character, for uh, blasting a clip, a, what, a 30 second clip from an hour long show. Let me know what y'all think in the comments.